good day everyone today we are going to study about elastic watcher watcher is an elastic search feature that we use to create actions based on certain conditions that we have uh, which periodically evaluate using dsl queries on the data which we provide to the elastic search watchers are of two types uh, threshold alerts and advanced watch but today we are going to only study about advanced watch advanced watch this type of watcher has four sections namely triggers inputs conditions and actions triggers contain the scheduler which checks for the condition in every given specific time and input section it contains some dsl query and an index uh, name or pattern in which we in the work, uh, watcher will work this con the third condition is the third part is condition it contains the actual painless condition based on which alert or watcher will get qualified or else will get ignored the fourth section is actions it contains the message that has to be sent to email or the logging action or slack etc now we are going to see the actual practical implementation of a watcher so on three lines we when we click uh, we go to stack management option in management section in the stack management uh, in alerts and insights on left hand side there is watcher when we click on click on watcher it says that you don't have any watcher is yet so we create an advanced watch we give it a name like testing watcher okay and then in trigger section we just mention uh, one minute so that we can see the action in practical time in match section in input section uh, in match we are going to add a field uh, agent dot type and this would be file beat and in indices uh, we are going to add the index logs hyphen star so our index section is complete and in this condition section we are going to uh, implement the condition and so let's say uh, if our mm, if our condition is if our condition is greater than just one then we will see the logging action that there are uh, some documents in this in, in your index and the threshold is just uh, one so it will provide us the logging action because we have taken greater than equal to con uh, condition as one but if it would it would have been more then uh, the logging action would not have been triggered so let's create the watcher Now we will see some uh, execution history in just a minute. Mm. Meanwhile, we can just uh, we can just check the watcher again. Uh, this is ID and this is name. This is state as we can see this is active and condition last met mm. so we will see the condition here if it mats, meets or not and uh, last and the condition was last checked and the comment section and action what action has been taken so i think one minute would have has been. let's wait for a few more seconds or yeah, uh, our condition has been met. So if we check here uh, in this JSON, in JSON data, uh, we can see that uh, watcher ID. So we can see here this in this action part, 
our action has been implemented i my logging action logging status is success and there are 118 documents in uh, our index and threshold is one so let's now take this part as uh, this uh, condition as uh, suppose 1000 now we will see that if uh, the threshold if um, the you know, watcher is triggered or not let's go to watcher again and edit it so now here i'm going to implement thousand so now let's see if mm, the watcher will get implemented or not now we will have to wait for one minute again to implement the watcher uh, this was second watcher before changing the condition again this was triggered and we can see 118 documents So let's wait for a minute. Uh, meanwhile, we can just check the watcher again. So what I've changed is I have changed the condition part here. I have changed it to greater than or equal to thousand. Uh, can, we had the documents about 118. So this time, if the document count is less than thousand, then the um, uh, watcher will not get triggered, and we will not show this action part into the Mm, watcher so i think the time one minute has occurred so now let's see the watcher uh, it says that uh, the condition has not been matched met so if we see the json data so at the end we cannot see the action part here there is no action and hence we can see that uh, the watcher has not been mm, triggered so this is how this watcher uh, works in Elasticsearch. Thank you. Uh, please like and subscribe our video. Thank you very much.